Hi, this is Ariel from the NKS team. This is a short video on standing up an Amazon EKS cluster on NetApp Kubernetes service. First thing we'll do is we'll select Add Cluster. Then we'll select Amazon EKS. Notice that we automatically populate the VPC fields and subnets. Uh, you also uh, get three node cluster, so there's no need to attach worker nodes uh, to the master that comes with EKS. Uh, that's all available right here. You can also customize the size of the uh, nodes if you so desire. And here we're going to come in and change the region, both uh, North Virginia and Oregon are available and notice how automatically the VPC field is populated and then we just need to come down here and select a couple of subnets select them from separate zones there it is and then we'll go ahead and save that Notice those are represented here. We don't need to customize anything else. Hit submit. Uh, we can use the cluster name that was created or we can generate a new one. We can customize it. Uh, we, this cluster comes with uh, etcd and Helm and the latest supported version of Kubernetes on EKS. We'll go ahead and hit submit. And we'll wait briefly while this process gets started and uh, we'll start up again once the cluster is built. There it goes. And we're back. Let's take a look at our cluster and see how long that took. We'll dig into the cluster detail page, go to the event log, and note that it took, uh, started at 106, ended at 125, so in about 20 minutes. We have our standard cluster uh, with three nodes. Uh, note that I can always come in here and edit the auto scaling. So if I want to uh, add the amount of nodes uh, included in my uh, pool, I can manage that from here. And then I also have other cool little things like the cube config file, which will enable me to uh, easily uh, get started uh, managing that cluster. Uh, thanks again for uh, watching the video. We hope you'll give this a try. It's all available today to you if you just go to cloud.netapp.com and go over to NetApp Kubernetes service. You can get started doing uh, using NetApp uh, Kubernetes service today.